Okay. Can you take those things off your head? And what is this you're wearing? Dad, I'm just chilling. You're just sitting with this lipstick. And you want me to go back to Nigeria? Yes, you make medical doctors in Nigeria, they make money. I'm an academic doctor, Dad. Hey! A woman wanna go! Hi, hi, welcome to yet another time with me. My name is Chacha Wabara. I'm so excited to be doing this movie review. Today we'll be reviewing the movie known as Clash is a 2020 Nigerian movie directed by Pascal Atuma. It's called Clash. I'll see you on the other side after the highlights of the movie. To talk to you about your dad coming. Can you take those things off your head? I want both of you to be at your best behavior. He's going to spend some time with us. Hi, Dad. Hi, Mom. This is my friend, Charlene. I'm suspecting that that white girl is still here. Did you see her there? And what is this you're wearing? Dad, I'm just chilling. You're just sitting with this lipstick. Is this how you're going to be? Coming here to yes, mess everything up? Go, get out. My uh, wonderful son here. He's a doctor too. Yes. That's impressive. It takes a lot of hard work. Dad, you want me to go back to Nigeria? Yes, you make medical doctors in Nigeria. They make money. I'm not going to be a medical doctor. You're not going to be a medical doctor. I'm an academic doctor, Dad. Hey! A woman wanna go! I thought you'd be proud of me. Proud of you? I have something really important I want to tell you. What? Did you get a woman pregnant, my son? He did not. No, Dad, I didn't get any woman pregnant. So, who is this person you want to marry? Your mother is grooming you, Chechi, to marry you back uh, home. Uh, let's leave the Chechi for now, uh, first of all. Forget about any traditions or taboo. The most important thing is love. Pray. Pray that when you get married, you get married to a good woman. You get married to a good woman like me. Clash is a Nigerian movie, like I said, set in Canada, I think. Starring actors and actresses like Oni Oboli, Brian Hook, Stephanie Linus, Melissa Determin, Pascal Atuma, Daryl, Isaac, Naima, Sondiata, Chelsea Howell, Deshaun Francis, Percy, and Doom 4. Right, so it talks about this lady who is in Canada with her kids, a boy and a girl, Omoni Oboli, and she's a nurse. And uh, married, but her husband is in Nigeria. And so one day she calls her children, one is doing his um, PhD. They didn't really talk about the daughter, I can't remember where the, what the daughter was doing at that time, but they were grown ups anyway, both unmarried. So she called them and told them that their father was coming, and they're like, what father? Your father is coming, and they're like, please. She was, she was telling them that they should be on their best behavior, that she doesn't want any any issues with their father, her husband, and all of that. So now, finally, the husband comes, <laughs> a very funny guy, and I think it's Pascal Atuma. I might be wrong, though. So this guy comes, their dad, and he depicts the normal Niger Igbo guy and the way he speaks and all that. So she was now showing him his room. It's kind of like a comedy because it just shows the normal thing that happens with Nigerians when they go abroad and um, when they go to visit their family. The normal, you know, unedited things that you see. Um, it was funny. It was an engaging movie. It showed the usual struggles, you know, the culture shock for the father when he comes and sees that the boy's girlfriend comes and stays or the kind of guy's daughter Ada was dating and he was like, oh, no, 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 no. You cannot be dating someone that has hair all over the place or earrings or all of that. You know, the girlfriend of his son, he was always watching to see if she was spending the night in the house and Momono Oboli is like, leave them, they are grown. Grown what? He would say. You know, it was an easy drama. I would say that it was an easy drama that would just take you along because it's easy for you to identify with the different characters coming up in the movie. Like there was nothing complicated, there was nothing annoying, there was nothing boring, dear, because you're seeing your life, you're seeing how it will be if, if you are in that situation. And so it was easy to carry the audience along, which was what I liked about the movie Clash, okay? And there was nothing bad anywhere. The lighting was good, but the sound was awesome. Oh, the filming was somehow, I don't know, it was kind of like, let me not go into it. It was just okay. It was just there, right? I liked how it ended. Everything was okay. Like I said, no complications. One or two things tried to happen in the movie. I'll leave you to see the movie yourself so that I don't spoil things for you. But it's a good watch. A good watch any day, any time. And if you haven't seen the movie, do look it up. The Clash, Omoni Oboli, you would enjoy the movie. And which brings me to an end of this movie review, however short it is. And I'll be rating the movie a 6 over 10. 
which brings me to the end of the movie review. Up there, you'll see my Nigerian movie reviews, my Korean movie reviews, my Chinese movie reviews, and then again, my movie reviews, okay? And if you haven't subscribed, do hit on the subscribe button. Do turn up your post notifications to be alerted when new videos come up, yeah? Good. So I'll see you next time. Thank you so, so much for being with me. Thank you so, so much for watching. Till I see you next time, it's bye for me. Bye. Bye. Thank you.